How to make a Santa or Father Christmas puppet. Take a piece of A4 paper and colour it in or use a piece of wrapping paper that's roughly the same size. Fold your piece of paper in half by bringing the two short edges together and unfold it. Now fold the top corners of your paper so that the top edge of the paper is in line with your centre fold. Then fold your paper in half. Tape your diagonal folds together. This is going to be your puppet body. The point at the top will be your puppet's hat. Opening your puppet body through the gap at the bottom, refold and flatten your paper so that you have the tape seam at the back. Take another piece of A4 sized paper Fold the paper in half by bringing the short edges together and then fold it in half again. Unfold it and cut along your fold lines. You should have four strips of paper. Take one of these strips of paper and fold it in half. Cut your folded paper into an oval shape by cutting off the corners. You should have two oval shapes. On one half of one of your ovals, draw Father Christmas's face. Uh, if you're using wrapping paper, it's best to use the plain side. The other oval is going to be Father Christmas's beard. Scrunch this up, then unscrunch it and lay it over Father Christmas's face. Tape the bottom of the oval and fold it back down so Father Christmas can see where he's going. Arrange Father Christmas's beard by pinching the paper so that it fits nicely on the oval below. Take another one of the bits of paper that you cut earlier and cut off a strip. Cut off one corner from each end so your strip has points. Now scrunch and twist the strip of paper. This is going to be Santa's moustache. Fold it in half and tape the folded edge between Father Christmas's nose and his beard. Might need to squeeze this in a little bit. Then arrange Father Christmas's moustache. Now stick Santa's face onto the body that we made earlier. You can use tape or glue I'm using sellotape folded back on itself to make it sticky on both sides. Next, the hair and hat brim. Take another strip of paper and cut out a semicircle that's a little bit smaller than Santa's face. Scrunch up your paper, unfold it and then make a series of small cuts to fringe the edge of the paper on the same side where your semicircle is. Lay the paper so that the semicircle frames Santa's face and then turn your puppet over and fold the paper strip around. Secure it with tape. Then bring the other bit round and take that too. Fold down the top bit of your strip of paper to make the trim on Santa's hat. And give it a little squish and a pinch until you've got exactly the right position that you're happy with. Now for the bobble. Take the bit of paper that was left over from your moustache earlier, cut off a bit, twist it and scrunch it into a ball and then tape this to the top of Santa's hat. Now he needs some mittens. I'm using felt tip pens to draw Santa's mittens and cuffs. Now I'm going to cut them out. And he needs some arms. 
I'm going to take another piece of paper, which I can colour in or swap for wrapping paper. I'm going to fold this strip of paper in half and then cut it along my fold line. Taking one of these bits of paper, I'm going to roll it up and secure it with tape. Then I'm going to take one of my mittens and tape it onto the end. This is Santa's arm. I'm going to lay Santa's arm on my puppet and then put a little bit of tape underneath his arm and fold the rest of his arm back down again. And I'm going to repeat this on the other side. He's got his arms up in the air, so I'm just going to fold them down and put a little bit of tape on the top of his shoulders to stop him from always having his arms flailing. Okay, Santa's finished. So now I'm going to use him as a puppet. I'm going to put my hand inside the gap at the bottom of the cone so I can wear him like a glove puppet. Ho, ho, ho. Wonder what Father Christmas would wear if he wasn't wearing red. Mm -hmm.